Hey everyone, Cheryl Ann here again. Um, today I'm going to be doing a little bit of a different tutorial using the Pristine Eyeliner from Unique, of course. Um, and as you can see by the end, this is a pure white liner um, as opposed to the perfect color, which is black. Okay, and just to let you know, I don't really have anything on my face um, right now. I did put some line, some of the perfect black liner on my top lid, just so you can see the eye, concentrate on the eye this time. Um, and do want to go over that these eyeliners, lip liners, they are um, smudge proof, water resistant, can wipe them off, get a shower. I've actually showered with them. <laughs> By accident a few times and um, they stayed on until I use the makeup remover um, and then they come right off which is nice they come off when you want them to but not when you don't want them to um, so probably wondering what can you do with the white eyeliner what would that be used for um, there's a few ways you can use it I'm going to show you um, two different ways today um, one way I do all the time just about every day unless I just forget about it um, and then there's another way that I sometimes do as well so the first way I'm going to show you is I'm going to line right here on my waterline which is right above the eyelashes so I'm going to close up here and if I blink it's just because I have contacts in it's not anything with the product so I'm going to come in here and just on this water line, I'm going to be pretty generous with it too because it is white. So it's, um, you know, you want it to be able to show through, show up. And I just go all the way in to the edges, just like that. Very simple. If you get a little bit extra, you know, just touch it up with your finger. Now, you can see this eye has it, this eye doesn't. I'm trying to get close up without scaring you guys. <laughs> um, it makes my eye look a little bit bigger as opposed to the one that doesn't have it on. Now, you can just, you know, go and do both of them, go about your day, whatever you want to do, or you can go back in with any color you want. I just, I like the perfect, I like the black. Um, and you can go under your lashes and under that white line. And you can just line however you want. You wanna just do the edges. Just like that. And that's going to create a little more drama, open the eye up even more because you're even accentuating that white a little bit more by having that black contrast um, right there. So I'm just going to do that because that's normally how I would line. Um, maybe I'll take it in just a little bit more so you can see what it would look like if you went about halfway over. And if you want a smoky eye, you could just blend that in as well. You can see the difference. You know, I went with it, one not with it out. So I'm gonna go ahead with in this eye, and I'm gonna use just the perfect liner on my waterline, and then you can see the difference in the different techniques. I'm sorry, guys. It's just my contacts tend to dry out my eyes, not the product. And that's another thing, these are hypoallergenic. And before when I've had other products, other eyeliners, I've always had a problem with the kind of itch. When I do it, they tickle my eye, and it was very difficult to do eyeliner. This does not, I do not have that problem with this product, or any of these products, honestly. And this stuff goes on very smooth and creamy, which is nice. Okay, so you can see the difference. I've got a tight water line um, with the perfect black on this eye. 
and then I've got the pristine on the water line with a black underneath it um, just for to accentuate it extra and then the other thing that I do this is what I do just about every day again unless I forget <laughs> is I go in um, to the inside of my lid just like this and I just kind of trace that inside line just like that and usually I'll take a brush and I'll soften it up a little bit um, I don't have one on me at the moment um, yeah this looks a little messy it'd be a lot tighter than this I apologize guys I don't have my brush on me at the moment um, but as you can see it just lightens up that inner part of your eye um, you know I just blend it out or I'd sharpen my pencil a little bit more and get it just make that line um, a lot clearer and I can do it on this side too because if I was just going out I would do it on both eyes And this never happens, guys. I just kind of ran my pencil into the um, into my hand before I did this, so it got a little clumped up. You know, unless you're a klutz like me, that's not going to happen for you. But you, know, you just go in the inside like that, and then that brightens it up even more. So it's not something that when you do the inside of your eye like that, it's not something that's going to necessarily pop. And you can even do this with a light colored um, or silver color um, eyeshadow. I would use like a white or a pearl, you know, some some light color. And not it's not called white, but you know what I mean, just so you kind of understand how you would do it. And you can just kind of put it in the corner of your eyes like that. And that's going to add some brightness um, as well. If you're going out for a night look, you may not want to do that. Um, but since I wear my makeup all day, I usually will do this look. And it just adds a little bit of brightness to that inner part of the eye. And as you can see, again, this one is lined on the waterline with the pristine. And this one is with the um, perfect. And then I just have a little bit of the perfect underneath this eye. Um, just so you guys can do it. I'm not going to do the lashes because I just wanted to focus on the eyeliners today and just show you a really cool technique. Um, honestly, if I'm not working and I'm just going out for the day, I really like this look because it just makes my eyes look brighter and lighter and fresher. And who really doesn't want that <laughs> going out? You want to look like, hey... This is how I wake up in the morning, even though we all know better. <laughs> you know, I like to give that illusion. Um, so I want to just go ahead and do that little tutorial for you today, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions about the products, the colors, please, 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 please message me and let me know. And I'd be more than happy to give you a free beauty consultation. And we can discuss what products, what colors will work best for you. So I hope you all have a great day. Take care, and I will talk to you later. Bye.